All right, I'm going to show you how to make a simple 3D effect, all right? So what I'm using here is just uh, my iPhone. Just simply going to bring it to the camera. And my goal here is as I take a picture, I want to keep it straight and just barely move it to the left or to the right. So I'm going to take one shot and then barely move it. All right, so I got two shots. Uh, in order to get into my computer, I'm just going to use my AirDrop. So if you come over, and if you set up your computer for AirDrop, then you can um, set it up and it'll find your computer. You just check the images you want to send. So yeah, check those. And you click on that. It should be sending right now. There we go. And now we're receiving on the computer. So next what I'm going to do is I'm going to, there we go. It says it was canceled. Let me see if it came through or not. All right, cool. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag one of these images to a new column and drag the second one right underneath. All right. So one of them is going to be more left and one's going to be more right. And I think, as you can see, these look like they're sideways. So a couple things that I'm going to do here is, and I need to do the same thing on both. But with scale, I'm going to scale it back to about 40%. Actually, let me go 30%. All right, that's good. So I'll do that and bring this to 30%. And then uh, I'm going to rotate it. So I'm going to rotate it 90 degrees. And this one here, I'll rotate it 90 degrees. OK. So now I'm trying to figure out which one's left and which one's right. So this one looks like the right one here. So the right one, what we're going to do, if you come over to this area here in Resolume, as you can see, I'm just using demo of this version. But uh, the right one, you're going to get rid of the red. The left one, you're going to get rid of the green and blue. So now you've got this 3D image, and it may or may not be uh, accurate. As you can see, one looks a little bit above the other. So I'm going to try to adjust that. So that looks like the red image. So it's going to be the Y position. Let me see. So I'm just clicking the Y position. As you can see, this button will line up with the other button. I kind of want to do that. that looks about right. And that should be about it. So what I'll do is I'll just put onto the display here. And here's our image. And if I put on my 3D glasses, I'm going to see. Yep, that looks fairly 3D. What I'm going to do, though, so I'm going to come back and I'm going to move these a little bit closer together. So that's going to be the x-axis or axis. Uh, so let me just move. Whoop. Looks like that's moving away. So I'm going to bring that back to zero. And let's click on this one here. All right, so as you can see, the red's moving closer to the blue here. Like so. So just bringing that a little closer. I'll come to the output here just so I get a full screen. Yep, that looks better to me. So that's it, guys. That's how you... Uh, 
do 3D picture using your iPhone and Resolume. Hope you got something out of this.